Alarm. Ambulance companies are warning proposed cuts in the state budget could have dire effects on their services and in some cases even put smaller ambulance companies out of business. News Channel 9's Rob Hackford spoke with both AMR and NAVAC, two companies who feel the effects but in different ways. The state's network of ambulance providers say every time they transport a Medicare or Medicaid patient, they lose money. <laughs> totaling $31 million a year statewide. But with Governor Cuomo looking to balance the budget, operators say that deficit could grow even larger. And the truth is that most ambulance companies uh, operate with a pretty low margin. So it costs us a lot just to put the ambulances out in our garages, just to roll them out on the roads. And so if we lose that extra money, it could be uh, a change for us. AMR says the cuts have to do with their reimbursement for transporting patients who receive state assistance. Right now, 80% is paid from Medicare, but the proposed budget could eliminate the remaining 20% paid by Medicaid. It probably wouldn't put us out of business, but it will, there's all smaller agencies that it very well may. And then we've got to make up the difference. Those ambulances aren't going to be available uh, like they are now. The funding plays an even bigger role at smaller nonprofit ambulance companies like NAVAC in North Syracuse. They handle about 7,000 calls a year and staff four ambulances every day. If the cuts go through, they'd have to make up about eighty dollars to $100,000. Could impact our staffing. It could impact our ability to buy ambulances and equipment. Uh, it, currently, we have four ambulances every day on the road. We may have to cut that down if, if we lose that kind of money. A much larger and for-profit operation, AMR says the cuts wouldn't affect their services, but would still have an impact. We would be speaking with insurance companies or look at how much public education we're offering. This kind of funding really can't just go away. Uh, I know budget times are tough in Albany, but it's going to be a big deal if it goes through. In Syracuse, Rob Hackford, News Channel 9. Now, an ambulance rally is actually planned in Albany tomorrow. We're told several Central New York operators are planning to attend. We'll let you know what happens there. Christy? All right. You know, I've